welcome back to my channel and into another Dollar Tree haul. If you are new here, welcome. If you're returning, thanks for coming back and watching my videos. Um, if you are new, please don't forget to hit that like button, the subscribe button, the little notification bell thingamajig, all that fun stuff. If you like disregard all of those dirty dishes, I will do them, I promise. Um, what was I saying? Anyway, I'm going to show you all the things that I bought at Dollar Tree this week. I'm excited. I found some nice little Easter and spring themed things. So that means that a Dollar Tree DIY is coming up. Um, hopefully I can get that done this weekend. And we are going to turn you around and get started. <laughs> iced again today like I it's like three o'clock or so we left out of work early it's probably like 3 30 I would say disregard all of this stuff in the background I apologize um it's Thursday so my house is starting to look a little rough Saturday is cleaning day in my house so um anyway the point is is that it's iced again here in Missouri and I am like over the weather I went out to my car, had to de-ice it, I got out of my car and busted my ass on the floor, broke my elbow. I mean, I didn't break my elbow, but I busted my elbow hard enough that I probably could have fractured it for real. Anyway, guys, we're going to go ahead and jump right into this Dollar Tree haul. I hope that everybody's having better weather than me. Um, and... Yeah, I hope you guys don't get it anymore. I'm so sick of the winter. It's in unreal. So I picked up a couple of different um, glass um, containers here. This is just the, like, it's kind of, you know, sits like that. Um, I like how it's smaller at the bottom. I picked up one of these little jars for a dollar. Obviously, everything's a dollar at Dollar Tree. Um, I just got off work, so my brain's kind of, you know, going 90 to nothing. And these are made from the Libby brand, which is made in Turkey. You guys see that? It's not like the normal, these aren't like the normal glass Greenbrier ones. So, I don't know if that means the quality is any better, but um, I like the shape of them. Um, I picked up some of these huge giant eggs. Uh, you guys know who watch me know that I have three boys. So I got a basketball, a football, and a soccer ball um, for their Easter baskets. I don't know what I'm going to put in there, but I just thought they were fun. So I got them. Over here, I got three of these little bunny. Look how cute he is. Three of these little bunny baskets. We don't do a ton of things for Easter um, I got some of these little bunny picks in the pink and in the blue here. And then I just got a variety of eggs. These are big old yep, pink bunnies and these are chicks. And then we got some white bunnies here, I think. Those are really cute too. And then we got some carrots and just a package of regular ones. Um, I think I got rid of all of my eggs last year because they like I, we collect them up. Um, and then I've been putting them like in uh, Easter egg hunt after Easter egg hunt. So I got rid of all of the all of the eggs that I had last year and needed to get some new ones. So that's probably the just the beginning of what I'll get for the Easter egg hunts this year. I picked up two of these for the two little guys. I figured they would be cute and give them something to do as a little activity. Um in their Easter basket or we may do these before Easter who knows and then I also picked up these pom-pom kits as well um, these are the little chickens that you see there and then this one here is the little bunnies that you see up there and I thought that um, I might use these as crafting or I might have my kids make these if I need them to do something like on evenings like tonight where we're not gonna be able to do anything because it's cold and nasty outside then you guys if you guys can see this big pile of greenery that I got I went ham on the floral at Dollar Tree this week because I'm getting ready to I haven't really decorated my house 
um, since before Christmas. I haven't been in the mood. I haven't been feeling um, very uh, bright and cheery like normal. Um, since my dad passed away, I just have been kind of, you know, and just trying to get through. Um, but I finally feel like I would like to bring a little brightness into my house. So I picked up um, some of these. I'm going to just show you like one of each of the different ones I got. This one just says, uh, Bonnet de Verdure, um, or whatever that says. And it's just got like yellow berry looking things on the top of that. And it all kind of looks like, um, they're velvety and nice and, um, I don't know, just very farmhouse. It's kind of got like an overcast to it. The camera's not doing it that great of justice. I have a whole bunch of onion grass here too. And then this bouquet, they're all called the same thing it looks like. Called a greenery bouquet. And it's got some purple flowers on it. Um, and some white flowers. And then these purple things coming up from the top. Let's see... And this one, I think, is supposed to replica, like, lilac, maybe. Um, but it's got, like, pinks and purples, like, little... It needs to be fluffed out, but you guys get the idea. Um, just very light colors. This one here has some yellow and, like, pinkish red berries on it. Super cute. Again, same one. I picked up, like, four of each of them. Um, this one's just, like, you know, sprig-looking like... Um, and I kind of like that as well. Obviously, I bought it, right? Um, so they just have, like, different ones. They're all called the same thing, but they're all, like, kind of made slightly different. Um, there's, like, four different, like, distinctive bunches that I've seen. You know, this one, like, is different than all the other ones. But it's the only one I found of that one. So anyway, I just bought a whole bunch um, and we're going to play with it and get to decorating. I think there's like a total of 10 or 12 or something there. So, and then like I said, I bought a whole bunch of onion grass. I think I would have liked to have gotten more onion grass had I picked up, I bought every one that they had that I seen. So I only got like two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them. Um, but I would have gotten more. If they would have been there, probably. Um, I picked some up. I picked up some of these um, little Easter eggs. This is a six-foot garland, and I'm not sure exactly what I'll do with these. I might cut them apart. I might hang them up on on my window. Who's to say? And then I wanted more of these. I only found two of them, but these are so stinking cute to leave just like that as decor. You could take them out and use them as decor. Um, I, if I see them, see more of them, I will be picking them up because I would like to have some more. Um, I just got these Crayola eraser top pencil tops. Like that's a good deal for a dollar and they're like the tops of crayon. So I thought that was super cute. I got, um, one of these little lighty up things, you know, to light fires with for a camping trip. And then I got two of these little squishy goo poo things for the two little boys also for the camping trip. Um, I don't ever let them play with this stuff because they get it all over my house and I don't like it. But since we're going to be outdoors, they could play with it. Um, I bought these two packages. I bought two of these little salt and pepper shakers. I'm going to be doing a DIY with that as well. And I just couldn't resist this little pineapple. This is the only one that I've seen, but I will um, use that in decor as well. And then I found these little pastry crisps. Um, mixed berries. There is, uh, I don't know how many in there. Four, maybe? Eight pastry, two per pouch. So there's four pouches in there. Um, and they say that they're like 100 calories. This one is mixed berry. And this one is triple chocolate. So we will see if the boys like those. Um, we'll see. And then look at these little guys. Super, super cute. They had something similar to this, I think, last year. I think the bags were a little bit bigger, and they only came, like, one to a pack. So these are a little bit smaller, I think, but they are so stinking cute. Then I just picked up some fun spring Easter-ish kind of napkins for lunch boxes. Working with Liam on his alphabet and his writing. And let me tell you guys, he hates to 
right and um, he just does, he hates it. Um, I picked up some Spanish moss here. I was looking for the green moss at my Dollar Tree, but they didn't have it. So I will try again. And if not, then I'll just pick up some up at Walmart for some DIYs that I'm going to be filming this weekend. And then I just got this one. This is more like a hay consistency. Um, but I'm going to need like a lot of those moss, green moss ones. Um, the green, you know, the dark green colored ones. And then I just picked up this deviled egg tray or Easter egg dyeing tray just uh, because, you know. And then the lastly, I picked up some more of these book bins because you guys know I'm going to be having some um, organization videos coming up for you guys in the next little bit. Um, and I'm going to try and get all that stuff done before we go on vacation at the end of May. So we will see. Anyway, guys, that does it for this Dollar Tree video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys are staying warm and not super cold. It's like 13 degrees here today. Um, and if, like I said, if you guys like Dollar Tree videos, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. And we will see you guys in the next video. Bye.